Now, General David Sejusa has commented on the arrest of former Rubaga RCC Anderson Burora. Norway is closing its embassy in Uganda this very month. I have the details on this story. Ugandans have roasted the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Monk. Can you shut up? That and much more is coming up in this bulletin. My name is Melaz Milo, aka Fula, and this is the Buzz UG. Subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. You can also follow me on TikTok, Amelads Milo, aka Fula. Now, preparations are underway for Norway to close their embassy right here in Kampala. In a statement released yesterday, the mission confirmed that the embassy will close at the end of this month, but development, cooperation, and engagement with Uganda will still continue. Norway's Foreign Affairs Ministry said that the closure of the embassy doesn't mean that there will be no more support for the country or less focus on the rights of women and minorities. <music> Away from that, now the Prime Minister of Uganda, Right Horrible Robina Nabanja, has said that government may be compelled to start demanding that all poor people go to the nearest police station and record statements explaining why they have remained in poverty when President Museveni has injected a lot of money to drive them out of poverty in various development and poverty eradication programs over the years. Uh, you tell us you got the PDM money. Why didn't you become rich? You got Emyoga funds. Why didn't you get rich? You have five or six acres of land. Why don't you use that land? We are still speaking peacefully, but time will come. We shall use some force. We want rich people. <laughs> Well, there you go. That is uh, the lead of government business, the Prime Minister of Uganda, Right Honorable Robina Nabanja, making it clear that very soon they will task poor Ugandans to record statements at police explaining why they are poor and yet President Museveni has put in a lot of money to make sure that everyone becomes rich in this country. Now, General David Sejusa, also known as David Tinyefunza, has commented on the arrest of former RCC Anderson Borora, who was arrested the day before at around 10 p.m. In a statement posted on his ex-handle, Sejusa condemned the manner in which Borora was arrested. Police of Parliament raiding a citizen's home at 10 p.m. night. Been seeing Mr. Borora uh, riding his motorbike in broad daylight. Why not stop the bike rider and effect an arrest if he has a case? Oh, come on. Come on, guys. Come on. <laughs> uh, that is uh, General David Sejusa, you know, commenting on this matter. Apparently, uh, Anderson Burora is detained at CPS. And uh, according to Kampala Metropolitan Police spokesperson, Mr. Patrick Onyango, he's being accused of uh, spreading hate speech and uh, malicious information on the person of the Speaker of Parliament. And uh, finally... Ugandans on social media have roasted the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Monk, after she said in the House yesterday that the members of Parliament confined in a Luzira prison are not corrupt and that we should stop calling them thieves uh, because there is a presumption of innocence. First of all, Honorable Members, we cannot say that our members are corrupt. We cannot, even if some... Uh, uh, even if some of our members have been arrested and they're in prison, there is a presumption of innocence. Honorable members, can you shut up? There is a presumption of innocence. You cannot say somebody is a thief. Well, there you go. That is uh, the Speaker of Parliament of Uganda, Right Honorable Anita Monk. Anita Monk is uh, the worst speaker Uganda has ever had. Very arrogant, disrespectful, corrupt, name it. Can you shut up? Morally, the speaker should be campaigning to clean up the parliament for goodness of millions of Ugandans. One time, she said she's carrying the cross for all. Can you shut up? Can't she use words like order in the house or lower your voices? She's not fit for that position. Can you shut up? 
How can one love this country with such language being used in parliament? After that, they come and tell us Mbu patriotism. Can you shut up? The worst set of parliamentarians in the history of Uganda and being led by the most corrupt speaker ever in the parliament. Can you shut up? And uh, finally, this is actually sad for our country. Uganda will never forget this parliament. Can you shut up? Well, those are some comments coming in from uh, social media. And uh, if you have anything you want to say about these stories, the comment section is uh, very open for you. My name is Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fula, and this is uh, The Buzz UG. Subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. You can also follow me on uh, TikTok, uh, Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fula. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Anita, manager Palm Hotel. We are located opposite Mukwano Mall along Rashid Kamis Road. You can get to us through the numbers on the screen. We have very affordable accommodation, free internet, DSTV and more other offers. You can follow us on all our social media platforms. We are Palm Hotel.